What's up everyone? So today is going to be super fun because I am going on a little bit of a trip to Columbus, Ohio. I had this, I had these plans on the calendar for like a few months now and I was originally going to just go work from Columbus and like take my laptop and work remote from Columbus. But then I was like, I have PTO and I need to practice what I preach and actually just take time off and rest and enjoy spending time with my best friend because she's on spring break. And so, yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. Yesterday, the power was out, so I didn't have a chance to go do laundry. So I had to drop off my laundry at like a wash and fold place. But I have it now, so let's go ahead and pack. By the way, I am leaving in like literally two hours, so we got to hurry up. So I'm just getting ready now. We're going to be going out to coffee and then we're going to go get a lunchtime beer and then we're going to go book shopping because there's nothing better than having a beer and then going to buy books and going to a bookstore, which is very exciting. But I did really want to quickly talk to you about boundaries while on PTO because I made a mistake that I generally preach to avoid, and that is that I checked Slack yesterday while I was on PTO, and I never do that. I checked it on my phone, but I we were driving like an hour from Ohio, like Columbus, and so, you know, I was like, okay, might as well. I was going through all my Instagram and Twitter, and I was like, okay, whatever, I'll just check Slack. And so when I checked Slack, normally I'm really good at ignoring things. Well, normally I don't check Slack, but I did. And I saw that there was a message for me and I was like, ugh, I normally like my sign or my status says I'm away, I'm on vacation, don't talk to me, you know. But I saw a question that had like a really quick answer to me and I was like, ugh, okay. Well, I didn't even really think that hard about it because I was just driving through the middle of Ohio. And so I was like, okay, let me just respond. As soon as I hit send, I was like, crap. I really do not want to set this expectation that I'm going to be responding while on PTO. So, you know, I sent the message, I responded, I answered the person's question, and they were like, okay, thank you. And then I was like, oh, what I need to like fix this right now. And so I followed up. I was like, hey, just as a heads up, normally I don't respond during um, my PTO. I just happen to be driving through the cornfields of Ohio and they were like, oh yeah, totally. Like, don't worry about it. I wasn't actually expecting. I saw your status. I just wanted to leave this here before I forgot. I was like, oh, okay, great. Thanks. Have a good rest of your day. And they were like, yeah, have fun and bye. So crisis averted, but, um, just wanted to bring it up because mostly to hold myself accountable because I'm always like set better boundaries. Like, don't talk to people on PTO, but, um, I did. And you know what? Whatever. I won't do it again. I just happened to be like browsing through my other apps and, uh, but yeah, I wanted to make sure that I set that expectation, um, right away. Cause this was someone that I'm like new to working with. And so, but they, they took it really great and it wasn't a big deal. But yeah, I will not be making that mistake again this vacation. I mean, if I make the mistake in the future, I'll just correct immediately. And you can do that too. Just send them, hey, a follow-up. Just set that expectation. Um, 
But yeah, just wanted to share that with you. As soon as I'm done getting ready, I will be out. Um, that looks good. Be out for the day. Get coffee beans, beer, and books. Name a better trio, honestly. This, um, this is not a beauty thing, but this e.l.f. No Budge Matte Stick Shadow really does not budge. As someone who has, like, oily eyelids, actually lasts pretty long. So, yeah. Boundaries. Let me know if you respond to people while you're on PTO. I'm curious. Or how do you, how do you set those boundaries for yourself? I must know. Going to the book loft. Is this how you get in? Yep. 